What is up everyone? I'm Scratch. Welcome to the channel. This video is brought to you by Rise of Kingdoms. So I just want to say a big thank you to them for sponsoring today's video. Rise of Kingdoms has been a great success since it launched in 2018, guys. And even today, after six years, it's still one of the major mobile simulation games in this space. Not only that, but they have one of the largest and most active community of players in the entire genre. Plus, it's still one of the top grossing games after all of this time. If you guys want to get involved, you can do so by clicking the link in the description down below or in the pinned comment. But why has Rise of Kingdoms captured the hearts of millions of players worldwide, guys? It must be success and 100% not a coincidence. Uh, it's built on three core strengths, right? And I feel like these are very, very important. A unique, flexible gameplay design, a warm and collaborative community atmosphere, and a development team that truly values its players. Now, let's dive deeper into these key aspects to discover how they've helped Rise of Kingdoms win over millions of players for the last few years. The first reason is the unique gameplay of Rise of Kingdoms. The developers have consistently innovated and introduced unique mechanics that offer players a never-before-seen gaming experience. One essential mechanic is the freedom to move your troops on the map. Additionally, the game lets you save customized configurations for up to seven war marches, gathering parties, PvE setups, or other event strategies. Like this, you're going to have a fully flexible army, and basically you're going to be ready to take on whatever challenge you might encounter. These seemingly simple mechanics contribute into making the game more immersive. Another special mechanic is the true collaborative system between players, encouraging genuine cooperation within the community through a well-developed alliance system. Trust me when I'm telling you that, guys. Alliances are everything in this game, and the social aspect of the game is what really, really makes this game so good. This is a fundamental pillar of the game, as many events and gameplay elements revolve around it. Alliances are crucial in Rise of Kingdoms, not only because they allow you to progress and grow much faster and develop your account, but the alliance system and overall the cooperation among players provide significant in-game benefits. Uh, it fosters a strong sense of community, right? Uh, allowing players to share resources and support each other. And moreover, when members purchase bundles, other players receive rewards, which is particularly beneficial for free-to-play players and low spenders. Another main reason why Rise of Kingdoms is so successful, guys, is that they have a great community atmosphere where some players, they've became real-life friends just by playing the game, and some of them, they've even found their soulmate. Now, this is something that we actually saw in our community, right? Where players found their soulmate and even got married. Now, one thing that really sets Rise of Kingdoms apart is that they really, really get involved with their community. They offer them support. And in some cases, they even share their stories to the world. Talking about events, guys, they have tons of in-game events. But sometimes they are taking it a step further and involve their community in real-life events and activities. They had a massive collaboration with the National Roman Museum, where they involved over 500 different alliances from the game, guys, for one purpose, to restore Rome's glory. And this event actually lasted for around six months. And as you may notice on the screen, the results are absolutely insane. Like the way they've been able to restore the entire city is just wow. The developers of Rise of Kingdoms have been the pioneers in this genre, guys, with their innovation and top-notch community support. Honestly, the game is just getting better and better with every single update. Additionally, the Rise of Kingdoms team pays close attention to players' needs. They held many offline meetups where they actively talked and interacted with their players, listened to feedback, to suggestions, and recently they actually announced a new remastered version of the game, where they're basically planning to enhance all of their graphics, talking about buildings and many other visual elements. This really demonstrates uh, their commitment to basically keep the game updated and appealing not only for the old players, 
but for the new players as well. Recently, they had some of their biggest updates that not only introduce new civilizations, new commanders, new seasonal stories, but it will completely remaster the entire game. Starting from world maps, troops, scenes, and the battlefield, so they can offer a truly three-dimensional experience. The game design of Rise of Kingdoms is highly successful without a doubt. And their serious attitude towards players is something that other developers should really look up to. Even after six years of operation, guys, this game has not been satisfied with the status quo, but continues to improve. Rise of Kingdoms not only provides its players with an exceptional gaming experience, but also has a profound impact on the entire simulation mobile game market. So even though a lot of games are trying to implement all of the successful features from Rise of Kingdoms, I still think that they have the upper hand. And that's mainly because they have the ability to introduce new features, make new updates, bring new civilizations, tons of different things that will still keep their players engaged after all of this time. But that was all for this video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. And as usual, appreciate all of you guys watching. Big shout out to Rise of Kingdoms for sponsoring today's video. And if you guys want to get involved, you can head over to the link in the description down below or in the pinned comment to download the game and try it out now. Peace.